Have you ever felt the agony of agape love? Meaning you love someone at all cost. You bear all harm, enduring every single wrong. It can be sacrificial, it can be painful, and it is selfless. But it's the love that God has for us. And it's the love that he calls us to all have for one another. Take a listen to this poem by Madeline L. Engel. Agape sounds so lovely, but it feels like agony. A costly emptying love, let its author to the tree. To love, to pour, to spend, to be left wanting in reply, tests the strength of love, begs a source most high. I love that line, begs a source most high. The way that we give agape love is by receiving agape love because you can't give what you don't have to give. Receive the love of God. Receive the love of God. When you mess up and he forgives you, he grants you grace and mercy. So when someone else offends you, they hurt you, they wrong you, they betray you, you remember the Lord. You remember his agape love and how he has forgiven you and how he has loved you. It's so hard to love people. But when we know his love through Christ, all things are possible. God loved us so much that he sent his one and only son to die on a cross for us. And Jesus, who is God, made that sacrifice in love. There is pain for a little while. It hurts, but the fruit of that love saves, it heals, and it redeems. If you're grateful for God's love, comment God is love and subscribe for daily encouragement.